Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, it's uh, Rad and in this whole video we are going to check into the Daily Dose of Tarot for uh, 30th of May uh, 2022nd and uh, should you be interested guys in a personal reading with me or if you do want to take uh, my Tarot classes you can check out the description down below and there you will see full list, uh, full list. You're there you're going to see my website, the link to my website on which you will see a full list uh, of my services and as well uh, their pricing. So with that said, let's uh, check on uh, what are the energies of the day. So the first card uh, that is going to be the uh, Five of Swords, uh, followed by the second one, uh, which is it, it's a good one. Uh, we do have uh, the Four of uh, Wands, and the last one, oh. Uh, the last one is going to be uh, the tower, right? Uh, those three cards. Oh, uh, that is going to be a day that we should proceed with. Uh, I don't want to call it extreme. But we should proceed with a uh, rather big caution. Uh, that is because, do you know this this sentence that say, uh, which is the irony of our life, it is that we hurt the most the people that loves us the most. Well, it seems that Monday is a such a day, which is kind of uh, unfortunate. And uh, that it is described here by uh, the Five of uh, Swords and the Tower, which is, by the way, consequences of uh, it's a consequence of the Five of Swords and the Four of Wands. So, what happens really throughout the day? Well, on the active scene, the day should be rather quite productive. Uh, what I mean is that throughout the day, uh, we get to finalize important tasks. We get to finish uh, very rather substantial enterprises and endeavors for us. The problem isn't into the finishing those things. The problem is how we are going to finish them how we are going to uh, lead into this very important convo or a conversation that we have with the uh, important person in our life, how we are going to approach our person of interest, how we are going to lo uh, lose, use, I'm sorry, so how we are going to use the leverage we have and all these, uh, and all the questions of such a type. So the results of our actions that we have, that we are going to put into Monday, uh, they will, they, there is a, a huge chance here that these actions are going to humiliate people that we do care a lot for them and that they love us very, very much. So is there a workaround? Yes, there is. There is a workaround and uh, the workaround, it is by understanding how far we can stretch our limits. Okay. And which lines we should not cross because in one day uh, we, we will have that affinity, that standpoint that no matter what we have to finish this. Okay. And at that point is not going to seem a big deal for us. Um, you know, what kind of a consequences these this actions of ours are going to bring to the others. Uh, but at the end of the day, the, the damage that we may inflict on, um, on situations and, or, and uh, on other people uh, will be quite significant. And by the way, that is also a vice versa. I mean, someone that we love a lot, it could hurt us throughout the day. That they may do something, say something, which is going to humiliate us. Uh, the very least, we will realize that that's not a person that we should put so much trust in. And this is going to pretty much ruin 
you know, the things we built with those people. It's just everything we have built with them, gone. It's no longer going to be there. However, there is a key point into what I am saying here, gone, no longer is going to be there. Uh, because it's not irreparable. What I mean is to take it like a shattered glass, okay? So you do something, you shatter the glass of, of, of your interaction with this person, whether about business, whether about relationship. Now, however, there is a unique opportunity coming out of, of such a um, doing. And the opportunity is to pick up the glasses and align them together, but make a, a different platter okay they make a different plate out of it so I, it's kind of like I, I take it like um more like a test here that's you know one thing ends and uh it's uh how can i put it into words Let, let's put it that way one stage of that enterprise ends with uh, uh i forgot the english expression here it's kind of like a fiasco, okay? It ends like that, but then you can go for a another stage with uh, with this situation, with this person, and so on and so forth. So it's it's very important throughout the day that we do give a very accurate understanding to ourselves. That is, what the consequences of our actions are going to do. Can we live with it, and can we recover? We can. Okay, that, that, that's given by those cards. But the thing is that are we ready to go through this recovery process? And if we aren't, then it's better to know our limits and do not cross those limits. Other than that, in a completely material gains, the, the day should be rather very, very good in a sense of that, like I said, we are going to be able to accomplish. We are going to be able to accomplish deals. We are going to be able to accomplish results and so on and so forth. Are people going to like those results? Well, if we don't care, that's irrelevant. Once again, all that matters is that the results are going to be in our favor. Just so we, we must make sure that these victories are going to be sweet rather than bitter. And one last thing throughout the day uh, we may be in i don't want to say danger but let's say exposed into a power pressure so <clears throat> we may abuse the power we have over somebody or somebody may use the power may abuse the power they have over us the only thing that comes out of it it is that we will understand that we are misusing our our position or the position is misused against us nothing much can come out of it aside from that we should understand that we should not trust that person or other people we will realize that they should not trust us so with that said this is the daily taro uh dose here for 30th of may 2022 hopefully you do enjoy it and you do like it guys and we're gonna see each other in the next one until then Bye.